Human beings are episodic creatures. Our projects, our careers, our relationships, our very lives are a series of episodes. And episodes have beginnings, middles, and endings. And endings have a really interesting effect on our behavior. And if we're aware of them, we can use it to our advantage. Let me give you two pieces of research that make this point. The first has to do with marathons. What is the age at which people are most likely to run their first marathon? The answer, age 29. That seems a little peculiar, kind of a random age. But it turns out that people who are 29 are twice as likely to run a first marathon as people who are 28. They're twice as likely to run a first marathon as people who are 30. What's happening? When we get to the end of a decade, we kick a little harder. This is a common effect of endings. You see it at other ages, too. 49-year-olds are three times as likely to run a first marathon as 50-year-olds. Endings help us energize. When the end becomes salient, we kick a little harder. The second piece of research has to do with gift certificates. Researchers gave two groups of people similar gift certificates with one difference. The first group had three weeks to cash in the gift certificate. The second group had two months. Now, our instincts would be that the group with more time would be more likely to cash in the gift certificate, and once again, our instincts were flatly wrong. The group that had three weeks was five times more likely to cash it in than the group that had two months. What do we learn from that? If you want people to act, give them shorter fuses rather than longer fuses. And if we take this incredible research on endings, it yields some very powerful lessons for how to motivate ourselves and our teams. First, make endings visible. When endings become salient, people are more likely to energize. Two, interim deadlines. Instead of having one long deadline, have multiple deadlines along the way. That will get people energized multiple times and you're more likely to hit your final deadline. Finally, if you want people to act counterintuitive as this may be, give them less time rather than more time. Shorter fuses versus longer fuses. If we're aware of endings, we can energize ourselves, we can energize our teams, and we can perform at a higher level.